This is Kathy Chase. Um, how do you premeditate a crime and expect to follow through with it? This is what I'm asking you. You know, you have the snap food stamps, you know, thinking I was trying to get me to snap or whatever, I guess. Um, and then the rainbows all over state programs and shapes all over state programs, um, which they are discontinuing and trying to then closing down a lot of these places and restructuring local government, obviously. How do you premeditate human rights abuses and murder in front of the public? Um, in front of the public, um, your claims about me are false. In one breath, you say I have something wrong with me, right? That's what you say. There's something wrong with me. You've called me yellow and all these other false accusations, which are untrue. And then you abuse me you've abused me by ambush because I didn't know what was going on in my life I had to figure it all out on my own and then um, if you had no liabilities you wouldn't be on the defensive and abuse me because I said I said I didn't know anything nobody ever told me anything so you think your reverse your reverse psychology is not gonna work because I didn't know and that should have been the end of it right there. That should have been the end of your little conversation and your conflict a long time ago. I said that I didn't know. I said that months and months ago. And then if you had no liabilities, you wouldn't be on the defensive and keep attacking me and my children, right? Which proves, you once again, that you have the liabilities. Um, example, if, if you thought I had something wrong with me, meaning if I had some, some sort of health issue, um, you know, like people that are handicapped or are really terminally ill with, say, cancer or something, would you go and publicly abuse them and attack them? No, you would not, right? Well, you, that's what you're doing to me. So you admit to the public that you're li you have liabilities, you admit you're at, at fault, and that's not my fault that you wanted to go about things in this manner. I've tried to reason with you, I've tried to be negotiable, I've tried to work with you, and you have been just vicious, viciously cruel. And so, as I said, in one breath you said there's something wrong with me, but you've all you've done is hurt me. That doesn't make sense. You don't make sense. You can't say that there's something wrong with me and attack me like this. You don't go attacking people that are sick or whatever. That's not right, which proves your guilt. Okay? Um, so, you know, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know why you're so mean. I guess it has to do with greed. That's the only thing I can think of. But I said, well, you know, anything's better than dying. If you're trying to keep me from getting to money that's rightfully mine, anything's better than dying. I'd rather live a poor life than be killed mafia style by presidents. As I said, there you you